Dr. Sean McCaffrey. All right. Hey, thank you, Clint. I appreciate the time to be here today. You know, it's exciting for me to be able to share the message that I've been trying to get out there. I recently was in Harvard speaking to a bunch of my colleagues, and it was interesting. You know, you, your message is powerful when you're talking about healthcare and the dynamics behind it and what you can do and you can accomplish. When seven of the people that are in attendance of your lecture come up to you afterwards and say, hey, do you offer concierge care? Do you offer care to people out of the area? Can we fly to see you or can we fly you to see us? I said, yeah, I can and I do. And it was great because I got to, I had dinner with one of them last night here in New York and I had dinner with one of them last night and they were talking to me and they were just, you know, describing everything that was going on. And they said, you know, doc, you, you worked on me a little over a month ago and my entire life has changed. Everything is different. Everything has changed. Now, what's so different about it? What's so amazing about it? What makes it so unique? It's getting outside the box, right? We get stuck in this model of, you know, you get a diagnosis, which leads to a prognosis. Oh, I got this. So I'm going to get that. It's not true. It's not true. It doesn't have to be that way. There's so much more that can be involved with this. And the concept of it is you just have to understand healing. That's what I tell everyone. You've got to understand how healing works. You have to understand the principles behind healing. It's not cookie cutter. It's not, hey, I've got diabetes, therefore I do this. Or, hey, I've got lupus, I do this. Everybody is unique. Everybody is an individual. And you have to treat them that way. But you've got to know what you're looking for. And that's what I did. I've spent my entire career searching for the cause, the root cause behind disease, dysfunction, everything that affects us. And what I found was there's a common theme. There's a theme running through there. So it doesn't matter to me if you get diagnosed with pancreatic cancer or lupus or celiacs. It's all the same when you understand what to do. Now, what's amazing about this, when you bring patients in and you start working with them and you get used to them and their families and how that all interacts, you start understanding and applying these principles of being a healer, everything changes. Now, the question is, what's a healer, right? Aren't we all healers? Aren't all doctors, aren't all physicians healers? I say no. I say less than 1% are. I say 99% of physicians are technicians. They're like mechanics. You go with a broken arm, they put it back together. But they don't make that arm heal. There's something else that makes that arm heal. There's an underlying principle that feeds that, that allows that to heal. It's not just putting the bone together. That's important. We have to have them. And they're great at acute care, emergency problems, traumas, accidents, infectious disease. And that's awesome if that's all that killed us. And it was at the end of the Civil War when modern medicine was invented. The problem is it hasn't been that way in 150 years. Today we die of cancer, heart disease, diabetes. Now we've got Alzheimer's that's growing exponentially across the board. I saw a representative from California recently was talking about the 10,000 diseases that affect mankind. 10,000. And the director for the National Institute of Health said, yeah, we got 10,000. We understand there's 10,000, but we have one cure. One cure. You have a $4 trillion healthcare system and you can fix one thing, hepatitis C. Well, that's real freaking great unless you got one of the other 9,999 problems. So if you don't have hep C, you're not curing anything. That's a huge, huge issue with our healthcare system. It has to change. And so I put myself out there saying, look, I'm going to revolutionize healthcare. I'm going to change things. And I put myself out there as the Robin Hood of healthcare. We're here to change it. We're here to do something amazing and we're going to make it happen. Right on, baby. I love the energy. And I, you know, the energy comes from confidence. And the confidence comes from experience and results. Talk about some of the results you've had. You know, I mean, you pick it. Pick anything you want. I haven't seen a diabetic in 20 years that I haven't been able to turn their life around completely and be non diabetic. Mm. You can take anything you can imagine. The young lady I was referring to earlier came to me and said, Gosh, you know, I've had chronic fatigue. I've not been able to sleep. I've had pain all over. I've been to every doctor you can imagine. I've been to Mayo Clinic. I've been to John Hopkins. Nothing has worked. I saw her once. I said, look, let's turn it around. Get the body balanced. Help the body balance. When you do that, you restore normal function. You remove the cause. Balance the body, and it is absolutely amazing what it can do. Testing? You like testing? You know, yes and no. I like to run, a, I run one test. It's called an integrated urinalysis panel because, to me, it's the single most important thing you can do. The body will hold on to things, right? You want to see what you're putting in and what you're throwing away. And as you're doing that, you get some idea. Gosh, am I giving stuff away? Am I getting stuff out? But we always go to blood, right? Everyone's going blood, 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 blood. And that's fine, but blood is a damage assessment. It tells you what's broken. Urine says, get out of the road, here it comes. You can run an IUP, which is probably the single most important test, in my opinion, to run on somebody. It is an epigenetic profile. It is a body 
audit. It lets you know what's going on, so you take the guesswork out of it. Because the reality of it is, man, to see is to know, to not see is to guess, and when it comes to someone's health, you don't want to be guessing. If you're tired of guessing and you want to see and you want to know, how do we find out more information about having you help us see the light? Yeah, I'm all over the place. Uh, you can catch me on Facebook uh, under Dr. Sean McCaffrey. I have a website. It's McCaffreyHealth.com. Spell that. M-C-C-A-F-F-R-E-Y health.com. Thank you so much, Dr. Sean McCaffrey. You are an inspiration, and we really appreciate having you.